Hey guys, welcome back to Caden's Corner. The NBA free agency cracked wide open as the Nets striked first on two huge players. Kyrie Irving signing a four-year $141 million contract and Kevin Durant signing a four-year $161 million contract. Will this be a good fit for two of the most egotistical players in the NBA, Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving? This will be a terrible fit. Kyrie is the most toxic player in the NBA and ruined all of the Celtics chemistry last season. With Durant expected to miss all of next season, Kyrie will be upset by the lack of immediate success to the franchise. This so-called super team won't win any championships in Brooklyn and won't even make it to the conference finals. Now to the other side of the country where the Warriors have had a strange free agency. They traded for D'Angelo Russell. Is this strange? Yes, this is very strange. The Warriors have three guards on their team now. Now you look at Klay Thompson's injury. He's expected to miss about half of the season. I could see the Warriors filling in D'Angelo Russell for Clay for the first half of the season. But what about the second half of the season? I could see the Warriors trading D'Angelo halfway through the season and trying to get some other role players considering they lost Andre Iguodala and Kevin Durant. Now the Celtics had a great free agency. They signed one of the most underrated guards in the NBA, Kemba Walker, to a four-year $141 million contract. I see Kemba Walker being a great mentor to Boston's young superstars such as Jalen Brown, Jason Tatum, and Robert Williams. If Kawhi leaves Toronto, then Boston will be a huge threat to the Eastern Conference and will reign terror for many years to come. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Tell me down in the comments if you guys would like to see me analyze more things for the NBA or for the NFL. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. See you guys.